Today we're covering a classic that's Yoko Littner from Gurren Lagann. Some of you may even know her from the When I'm Bored meme back in 2010. Drop it. Before the likes of Quiet, Yoko was the true OG bikini sniper, equipped with all sorts of ballistics. <clears throat> with that, here are my reasons why Yoko Littner is waifu material. Mild spoilers for the anime. Appearance-wise, she's got long bright red hair tied up with sticks and a skull hair clip. She notably wears a black bikini that's straight up fire, along with a striped pink scarf and short shorts that really shows off her figure, more than enough to distract Kamina. However, do keep in mind that she can be a little sensitive about her weight. As you can already tell, she doesn't wear too much clothing, which is clearly for uh, tactical reasons. Yeah. Given the nature of her outfit, this also means that her swimwear actually shows less skin than usual. By this point, it's glaringly obvious that she's got a nice pair of uh... Good enough to make you say good morning sunshine when you see them. Early in the show, the team rested at a bathhouse which led to the capture of the ladies. Now due to communist manliness, he gets tricked by some cheap video effects. To think that all this could have been resolved by Yoko's boldness. And unlike most girls, she wasn't embarrassed at all when Simon landed on her chest, responding only with a gentle smile, and later burying his face in them. On a side note, Yoko's actually quite good at cutting hair, which we all know by now is a lot harder than you might think. As a lady, Yoko naturally knows how to handle a long, hard sniper rifle. Yep. Wait. I say naturally because if you think about it, some of the best snipers in video games are actually female. Considered the best shot in her village, Yoko wields an anti-material sniper rifle, capable of piercing the heavens as well as the thick armor on most gunmen. Since the gun is powered by electricity, Yoko can load arrows into the chamber, thus allowing her to go hunting with it. While most snipers tend to shoot from the standard prone or standing position, Yoko is able to fire from all sorts of interesting angles. Her introduction to the show had her firing from a swinging rope. What a badass. As a testament to Yoko's accuracy, Princess Nia was once captured and held hostage by the enemy. Under the guise of shooting the princess, Yoko trusted herself to shoot past Nia's head and ran to the shoulder of the enemy's gunman, thus providing a rescue opportunity. Every sniper in the world needs some sort of close quarters contingent, and Yoko is no exception, because apparently she hides a handgun in her hair. While out on the field, Yoko is actually the most responsible in the team and is always focused on the task at hand, unlike somebody. Similar to the others, Yoko is a capable pilot, able to control a gunman herself or even the other half of Gurren Lagann. Yoko once mentioned in Kitan that she said plenty of experiences and plenty of kids to go with, making her imagination run wild. <laughs> Jokes aside, Yoko retired to a rural town disguised as a teacher called Miss Yamako. As seen by the images, we can see that she's a very fun and capable teacher that takes no prisoners, requiring only a glance to strike fear into the kids. When one of the kids got stuck in a tree, Yoko, I mean Miss Yamako, wasn't afraid to climb up after him. Unfortunately, this is the same time that some bandits decided to attack, thus allowing us to see that Yoko never truly lost her guns and that fighting spirit. A few minutes later. Despite their short time together, the kids all gave her a heartfelt goodbye and even recognized her as a legend in their textbooks. And lastly, I just want to mention that she even has her own music video called Stars, featuring her doing everyday things while wearing some very cute and stylish outfits. Wow. So what do you think about Yoko? Will you go hunting with her? Be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment on Yoko Littner, our favorite bikini-clad sniper. And if you didn't like the video, then just who the hell do you think you are?